Can this pair of red wings be fixed? That is the question for today's video, so let's stick around and see. All right, so what happened with this pair of red wings? Apparently this guy is a farmer. He got his foot stuck under a piece of farm equipment, getting his foot out, it ripped the hill. He sent them back to Red Wing. They said, ah. Uh -uh. So he sent them to us. Let's see if we can fix them. Now remember on the last video we had a pair of red wings and we talked about how the gimming was always coming off on the inside of uh, the insoles of this this type of boot this one's no different take a look so there it is completely unglued now this isn't as much the issue as it is this the insole is just completely worn out to where it just crumbled all the way where the nails were everything on this side of the nails is just crumbled and then the the actual upper itself is just shredded uh, there might be enough room for us to get some nails in there but we're going to see when we can get a new piece of leather in here Hey y'all, I know it's early in the process. We still have a lot of repair work to do on this pair of boots, but hey, if you're enjoying it so far, if you would, please hit the thumbs up button down below. And hey, subscribe to the channel. There's a lot more of this fun stuff to come. So I just want to throw that out there. Let's continue. All right, old gimming is out. We're gonna get these uppers cleaned off and I'm gonna soak the original insoles just because they are so warped. It's hard to take a pattern off of them. Uh, so we're gonna soak them in water so we can flatten them out. Okay, heat's gotten the boots broken apart. I'm now gonna clean off the uppers. Like he mentioned, we're giving these insoles a nice little bath here and uh, let those get stretched back out. And then once I clean off the uppers, we'll start building them back up. All right, these boots are really dirty. Like I said, this guy works on a farm in them, so a lot of dust and dirt on here. We're gonna get these off before we give them a bath because I don't wanna have a, uh, a mud bath. So we've said it in several other videos before, but for a lot of you guys that may be new to this video, uh, the leather that is used on these Iron Rangers is an oiled leather. So what we like to use is this oiled leather cream and it's made for this type of leather. So it's gonna put a color back in there, get these rehydrated so that it prevents them from cracking in the future.
All right, so a lot of people have asked in other videos, why don't you stitch the gimming on? It's not always required if you do it on untreated vegetable tan leather. It's rough, there's pores, the glue can get down there. But this guy works on a farm. We don't want these coming off, so we're gonna go stitch these. So the right foot is a lot worse than the, the left foot. This is the one that is just completely shredded, including the lining. And we're gonna try to get some tacks as close as possible uh, without it ripping through. It's gonna be tough, but I think we might have just enough to get it done. Okay, so both of these shanks are pretty rusty. They've been in that shoe for a long time. So we're gonna get the rust off of here, get these glued, and then we'll start corking and rebuilding the salt. All right, so we've got the shanks back in, new rands, new gimming new welts. Now it's time for cork, but we are unfortunately pressed for time, so there's not gonna be any hot cork. It's sheet cork. <laughs>
Okay guys, this pair of boots is done. Now, unfortunately, Heath had a prior engagement, so he had to step out. So I'll do the wrap up on this one. But uh, hey, before I show you what we did, just a quick little reminder. Guys, fall season is here. Winter weather will be here in just a couple of months. And you want to make sure that you're caring for your shoes and your footwear and your, your leather. So if you want to have your shoes or your boots resold, check us out at potterandsons.com. The link is down below. Also, if you're looking for any type of shoe care, leather good products to care for your footwear, again, you can find almost all of that at potterandsons.com. Again, the link is down below. Check us out. Okay, this pair of boots. Now, again, just a reminder, this pair of Red Wing Iron Rangers were sent to us uh, by a gentleman that works on a farm. He emailed him and I said, what did you do to your heel? Because Hey, inquiring minds want to know. This thing was blown out. He said he worked, you know, he got his foot stuck on a piece of machinery and when he pulled it out, it just yanked the entire heel off. Now he reached out to Red Wing. Red Wing said, no dice. We cannot fix that. So he sent them to us. And I think he's going to be good to go. Uh, now we had to start from scratch. So we put all new insoles in there, uh, new gimming, new cork, a different sole. He wanted a, a much larger, more firm sole. So we put a big lug sole on there. And, uh, you know, we didn't have a lot of the leather upper to tuck up underneath the heel. And that was the hard part. But we put a lot of nails up in there. And I think it's going to hold. I think he's going to be good to go for a while. Also, we just cleaned off the uppers and conditioned those really, really well. And like I said, I think he's going to be happy with this repair job. And I think he's going to be good to go for a while. So I hope you all enjoyed it. Again, I really appreciate you watching. And until next time, y'all have a good one.